Welcome again to the knowledge series by Janum Broking Limited. In this video, we will learn about another valuation technique, which is the dividend discount model. The dividend discount model is based on the idea that a stock is worth the sum of its dividends given to shareholders discounted back to the present day. Coming to the formula of the dividend discount model. So this is the formula for calculating the price of a stock using the DDM model. Here, P is the price of the stock, which we have to calculate. G is the dividend growth rate, K is the cost of equity or the required rate of return, D0 is the current year's dividend. This is the formula for constant growth dividend discount model. In it, we assume that the growth rate in dividend is going to be constant till perpetuity. Such models can be used to value mature companies whose dividends have increased steadily for a long period of time. Now, coming to the question, what is the dividend growth rate? It is the rate of increase in dividends paid by a company. It is very crucial for valuing stocks using the dividend discount model. Now let us understand how to calculate the dividend growth rate. The formula for calculating the year on year dividend growth rate is this formula where D1 is the present year's dividend and D0 is the previous year's dividend. Now let us understand it with an example. These are the previous 10 year dividends of the company. First we calculate the annual year on year dividend growth rate using this formula. For example, for the year 2012, we take D0 as the dividend of the year 2011 and D1 as the dividend of the year 2012. Using this formula, we can calculate the dividend growth rate for the other years as well. For the constant dividend growth rate, that is the growth rate to be put in the formula. We have taken it as the average 10 year dividend growth rate. We take D0 as the present year's dividend, which is the dividend of the year 2022 in our case. KE is the cost of equity or the required rate of return. Now plugging in the values of the D0, G and KE in our formula, we get the fair price of the stock using the DDM model. 